Hejsan folkens, med Purifying Blood, dag ser på Behind the Ink på pitcam.tv. Og jeg skal bare si hallo Mr. Glenn Reaper. Jeg er Tommy, jeg spiller gitarre i Purifying Blood. Hello, I'm Sander and I play guitar in Pure Fine Blood too. And I'm Anders. I spiel in drums in Pure Fine Blood. I have a Deutsch school learned. Mich, I auch. Have you? Yeah, I have. Why? Why is it banana so cool? No. I have a big pony pimmel. Oh God. We're kind of collectors, you can call it. We collect from. Good tattoo artists, a uh, lot of them, f lot of them from from uh, US, like um, Thomas Hooper, like Grimey, like Tim, Tim Lehigh, Lehigh, like Chad Koplinger. Yeah, we're Just privileged to be Norwegian, and we can spend all our money on tattoos. You know, it yeah. costs money. So we just, you know, yeah, we just brrr, it's collecting. It's like putting clothes on for the rest of your life. Mm -hmm. So that's why we want to make sure, and then we put a lot of effort in traveling. Yeah, we travel to get tattooed. I just came from a trip to San Francisco to get tattooed before this tour. He got this from uh, Wolf by the Grime, the yes. mighty, uh, famous tattoo artist. This from is awesome. Skull and Sword in San Francisco. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. And who did the other side? This is Chad Copinger. He's also from. Is he from Oakland? No. I don't know. He's American, but he travels yeah. a lot. Yeah, Great tattoo charming. artist. I'm just fascinated by it, and um, I like all mythology, not just Norse, like Greek and Roman. Mm. So, but, but it's not uh, it's not special for for you because you came from Norway. Of course, it's special. Of course, it, yeah, it's, it's really it is special, special actually. We're really uh, privileged to have <laughs> such a thing like that. <laughs> I mean, because you, some study it's a lot, you know. That's you, what it does. Yeah. It's tor. You got <laughs> tor every day tor with the really hammer, you yes. know, when it's thunder and lightning, it's <laughs> tor. That's his, yeah, he's riding his, uh, his horse up in the sky and he's yeah. got his hammer and like he... I don't want to talk that much about my knuckle tattoos, but my hands are, mm -hmm. are uh, <laughs> Thomas Hooper. Mm -hmm. uh, he's from UK, but he lives in New York. And um, yeah, this is also him. It's a uh, raven, one of Hugin and Munin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From also from the North Norse mythology, they uh, fly with. Uh, well, this is one of them, and they fly with uh, Odin. This is who you know. Man. We don't know yet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting the other one. I don't. Yeah. It's um, it's probably Hugin. It looks like Hugin. Um, this is typically his style with uh, with all the the patterns. Yep. Cool tattoos. And you just got this one. Yes, oh. the gold. This one is Adam Barton. Um, he tattoos from Santa Cruz, from um, O'Reilly's mm. tattoo shop. He's a good friend of ours. Uh, he also did this a while ago. Uh, this is pretty old. So good he's pleasure. yeah, he's he's a really good tattoo artist as well. I don't like I don't like the pain. I hate it. It, it get gets you worse. Pain, but you had a one, two well, big tattoos. Yeah, here. but they they were pretty quick. This like they it was like forty five minutes, both of them. They're really quick, and okay. I don't like pain. I mean, how, how was the back? He just started his back with a back piece. Yeah, I don't, I don't have one, but how was it? Did it hurt? Yeah, it hurts. Oh. I don't want to do it again, but I have to because <laughs> it's not finished. But that's <laughs> yeah. not why I get tattooed. You get tattooed because I like it, and um, uh, it's it's like uh, you know a collection from good tattoo artists. Yeah, this is a shark. I got this in Seattle by a guy called uh, Sean the African. Yeah. Yeah. It's really nice. I like it. Yeah, I'm really happy brutal. about it. Yeah. Sunlight, it it's like a shark. Yeah. If you ever see sunlight in the waves, he's like a shark. Yeah. yeah. Wild. It goes wild. Yeah, I'm fucking wild. I'll tell you that. <laughs> and then I got some inside my hand. <laughs> this is the best one. If I ever wonder, if I sit with a bear in my hand, and I wonder, who am I? <laughs> who, who the fuck am I? <laughs> no, it's like, am I gonna have another bear? 
And if I say, if I think no, but I see in my palm hair, keep on rocking in the free world, <laughs> I have no choice, no choice. I have to drink the beer. That's awesome. Yeah. That's awesome. I love it. And then what about skull? The, the skull is yeah. pretty cool. The skull. <clears throat> The skull we did, uh, I got a friend that he used to sing in Purifying Blood actually, and he's a tattoo, tattoo artist. And uh, we were having a party in his tattoo studio, me and him, <laughs> just drinking beer, get, getting ready to go out on the city and have fun, like, woohoo, like that. And then uh, we just thought, hey, let's do a tattoo before we go out on the city. And then uh, we just found a book with a lot of tattoos and just open it and like, oh, this one. And then... Uh, it was very spontaneous. Yeah, very it was, spontaneous. It was a spontaneous and uh, drunken idea. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but it's a good idea. And you also tattooed Glenn. Yeah, and I, and I tattooed him. Uh, he, he did the same one on his ankle. And, and, and yeah. the same in the same quality? <laughs> no. <laughs> tell him why Not you, at all. Tell First him. time I hold a tattoo machine and I'm fucking drunk. Okay. Do you think it's gonna be the same quality? No, 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 no way. fucking Never, way. <laughs> and then I got the ice. These ones, I've always <laughs> keep my eyes open. Yeah, yeah. I got an eye on you. I fall again, on again, on camera. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, motherfucker. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> And then you have. So that's, and then I got my back as well, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. It's work in progress. Show it. I've been working on this for a long, long, long time. And it's Molly Smayo. It's a Norwegian, the, Norway. the best Norwegian uh, tattoo artist. It's crazy shit. But I'm really slow. I had like four sessions, I believe. Maybe three. Three or four. It's a good one. It's gonna be. What is and it's it? in my uh, on my ass as well. But I don't I don't know if I want to show my ass to the camera. Of course you can. Do I want it? Yeah. Is that okay? Yes. You show my ass on the, on the camera. Your hands on the region okay. ass. Yeah. <laughs> but it's a loft, you know. It goes all the way down. So I, I imagine you know getting tattooed there. It's I mean, nice. Oh, I can't wait there. <laughs> Ass is the most painful. It's fucking pain. They tattoo right up in your spine and you think, oh shit, this must be the most painful place, you know, because your whole body is like, your teeth are like, because it's sticking right in the spine. Then when they come down to the ass, god damn. This is a souvenir from Santa Cruz, Santa Cruz, and Jason Anderson, my good friend that works in a Rayleigh's tattoo parlor, he did this. So Halger, the singer from Purified, and Glenn, the other guy. We all of us get the same one, you know? So this is just like a it's little a gang souvenir. Tattoo. It's not a gang tattoo, it's <laughs> a souvenir. No, this is tribute to Russell Means. Chad Koplinger did this, the same guy that did Tommy Snack. Uh, it was done at a convention, and this is the Dreamcatcher and some feathers. And just tribute to Native American, like, fighting for their independence. Mm -hmm. Glenn from Purified in Blood did this. It's all seeing eye, you know, we get the same one. And this is just, I don't know, representing evil. I guess, but it's good, I like it. It's in your face. It's nice to get tattoos on your thighs, because they will last long. And you can just collect pieces. And I got this, this is still new, so it's healing. This is a King Eagle, uh, a Norwegian one, and Ichibe, the Japanese tattooer, did it. So I'm, yeah, I'm lucky. I have a lot of uh, good tattoos. This is Marius Mayor from Oslo on the back. These are really old. It's a mix. I don't know. What do you see here? Uh, mm, I don't know. This one looks like a, a cobra head. Yeah, it's a snake and yeah. panther. Pantera. This is Tim Lehi from San Francisco Black Hawk. Tommy's got a t-shirt on himself. <laughs> You know, both this Tim Lee High, we love his work, so I choose to get both hands tattooed. This is uh, Fear No Evil um, from the band Grim Reaper. It's a British heavy metal band Sando introduced me to many years ago. Yeah, many years ago. Many years ago, so that's why I got Fear No Evil. It's one of their songs. 
song. It's a good song. Everybody Great should band. check out Grim Reaper. Dude. Yeah, I don't know. There was this time in my life where I was really into Ice and the Third Eye. I guess I was searching for Illuminati, you know, because it's so fascinating. Yeah. But then again, it's kind of bullshit. But I like it, you know. It's, it's, yeah, it's, but it's you cool. can change it when it's on your skin. <laughs> yeah, I know. But it, this is uh, hand poked in Thailand. So I like it. You know, it's also souvenirs. This is Anchor. It's hope. It mm -hmm. means hope. Yeah. Spider. This is old Marius Mayo. I really like this. This is Clem from O'Reilly's. You know, I can take if I take of this, I'm too naked to be on television. <laughs> I mean, hey, we saw his butt, so. And my new favorite tattoo is this. It's hidden in my beard. It's a feather. Ah. Okay. Cool. And it was fucking painful, isn't it? Yes, but it was too long ago, so I can't remember. But yes, it did hurt. How many years? Six. Six years? Mm. But there's... Everything is fine. I mean, the color yeah, is, this is still in and... Yeah, I don't know. I can't see it. So I don't know how much... Uh, Adam Barton did this. He's a friend of ours. He tattooed Tommy and me and eventually soon Sando. I don't know. Yeah, he's a great tattoo artist. You know, I just played a show, so I'm sweaty. You know, I didn't look in the mirror, but I, since she said I was okay, I feel comfortable. <laughs> and he doesn't smell like sweat, no. so everything is... And that's pretty good. I guess I didn't shower for four days, and I don't smell like sweat, and I've been he playing sweat, drums every day. He sweats a lot, but his sweat doesn't smell. I drink a lot of water. Water. Yeah. Weather. 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 Yeah. Weather. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, this is also Adam Barton. This, the Reaper. I don't know if you see it. <clears throat> yeah, I've got a lot of tattoos, I'm lucky. I've, I've been collecting for many years. So I started with my sleeves, I just bits and pieces. Jason McAfee, Dan Weissop, this is Gress, Clem, Tim Lehigh, Marius Mayer, Marius Mayer. This is uh, Derek Snodgrass, uh, Tim Lehigh, there's a raven here. And then this is Gress, Marius. This is the name of my ex-girlfriend, she's a great girl. And Jimmy Duval, my good friend from Oslo, did this. This is Thomas Super. This, and this is Tim Lehigh. This one. I like it when it's on the inside, because there's not too much sun, and it, it will stay yeah. in shape, you know, in good color, I guess, for a long time. This is uh, my chest piece. Uh, I did get this when I was 17 years old. Uh, old Marius, I like this a lot. True till death, I'm not straight edge anymore, but I'm, I'm, still, I'm still true. <laughs> and then, and then, and then uh, I got these two, the raven skulls. 